There is a peculiar shop in Walker that displays the creations of Minnesota artists and work from around the world. Reporter Sherelle Moore t tells us more about the peculiar painter. Someone asked, once um, described me as um, a little odd, but all painters are, she said. And I thought, peculiar painter, because all painters are a little odd. This is Jessie Stolzman, and she runs a little shop called Peculiar Painter. It doubles as a gallery and an art supply store. I moved here from Idaho. I sold my house and wanted to try having my own business. I was actually looking into starting a coffee shop in Montana, <laughs> but my family's from this area. Stolzman herself is an artist who started painting when she was 13 years old. I like abstract, figurative. Um, I have a style, it's called modern Scandinavian, and uh, they've got some around the store, but it's a uh, kind of an elongated, um, exaggerated, whimsical style with bright colors. What's unique about the Peculiar Painter is all the different types of artwork you can find from Minnesota and all over the world. Stolzman says she likes to know who exactly are the artists that are featured in her gallery. Um, pottery, candle holders, um, jewelry, scarves, um, and they come from Denmark, Sweden, Norway, um, some Finland, um, hand-blown glass, but then there's a lot of independent local artists too. The Peculiar Painter is the walker hub for many different artists. There's 12 different Scandinavian importers, six different potters, six local Minnesota painters, and five local jewelers. One of our um, best uh, loved artists is Monica Hansmeyer, who is from Turtle River, just north of Bemidji. Um, so I've got her necklaces, earrings, some bracelets. Um, Christina Holland is another favorite. She um, is a Bemidji native. She lives in um, Arizona now but I have a lot of her work. She's limited on space right now, but when it comes to finding work to fill the gallery, Stolzman says she finds her artists in a lot of peculiar ways, whether it's at a fair, through an email, or just walking into the shop. Some people have um, stopped into the store and just told me a little bit about their artwork, and then I'll invite them to bring some pieces in. Um, like Linda Holiday, the potter, she said, do you have any um, Minnesota pottery? And I said, no, but I'd like to. And she said, well, I'm a potter. Reporting in Walker with this week's In Focus, Sheryl Moore, Lakeland News. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.